It is warm and sunny, but that doesn't mean to let your guard down. What I've learned is this system takes positive energy and it strips it away. This is a virus. Uh, it's a virus program. This is why I'm more serious. I'm not just all love and light. I always talk about unity. That's the point of this video is true unity with those who you seek to connect with and build something where real large scale changes can take place. You hear lawnmowers over there. And um, I know that that's a frequency that is, you know, it's designed pretty much to distort what I'm trying to say, get me out of alignment. I'm focused on building and creation. And um, to, see, to see this realm without a virus, because I don't even want to come in contact with that virus, whether it be the programs or the actual beings who are living out those programs. It's a part of their systems within them and they're carrying out the agendas. So um, I must unite with those who seek to build and to create. I must continue to Feel that positive energy. I need to be more, and I need to be more serious, and not um, just as much of a, a light being, but also a protector. A protector means that I am guarding what is important for me, or else that virus will strip it away. I've gotten very furious at this virus because it does just take out everything that is light and good and joyful and it, it pretty much terraforms that if you look i always say look at look around what what are most people actually doing they're supporting the virus i'll give them, i've given many examples now mcdonald's is huge mcdonald's is a very big corporation it's a virus because you're just eating people and the same thing goes for burger king wendy's popeyes chick-fil-a and uh, it's proven, it's factual, you're just eating people. And uh, we must eat that which comes from the roots or that which comes from the cosmos, the frequencies. When I'm not eating the sun, but I'm, it's becoming a part of me. Um, you, you, you are what you come into contact with. You are what you eat and that which you um, can hear, smell, sense. Uh, anything in your environment so the all the shampoos and the the detergents the air fresheners the perfumes that's all becoming a part of your your, your dna it, it's it becomes who you are because you're in you're inhaling it you're ingesting it somehow so i'm more serious for sure because this is this is no thing to fuck around with nothing to fuck around with and I seem to be the only one, or in, at least in this area, speaking on this. I have those who I can connect with. And um, I know that there is support in ways I can't even see. Well, I'll say this, we must increase the spiritual density of this realm increase the spiritual density of this realm that means pyramids everywhere copper rods everywhere crystals everywhere and uh, there will be those who support the virus who will fight against it but if you look at this land you know there they said we we saw structures everywhere all across the land all the way from south to north, all the east to west, every square inch, and close to 250 million structures, all destroyed, 
pretty much all destroyed. A few just barely hanging in there. But the point of these structures were to bring a harmonic flow everywhere. And to be in that creative mindset, that intelligent mindset that they've worked so hard to destroy. It's the program, it's the virus program. I walked into Mariano's today, just looked into the eyes of one of the workers and I can just sense the soulless, worthless, pathetic vessel. I just wanted to strip that, squeeze it and strip the fuck out. Man, that's how strong the fury is. You don't, you don't really see it, you can feel it. It's a virus program that runs this entire realm. You must be serious and adamant about, you know, your, your vibration, your frequency, because you're the one who has that soul. You're the one who has that protect, that spiritual protection. These beings, they don't have any spiritual protection. If you go around them, they'll get very scared because they know that you're, you, if you are a, a being of spirit, soul, and force, they will be truly scared because of my spirit animal. One of them is a lion, and, what, and I'm recently figuring this out. I had the blue jay and the lion, two very strong spirit animals with me. And I, I'm finding that if I don't like something about someone, and if they're, they're just, I sense that they're trying to like harness energy from me, just slowly, just creeping in, that lion will just come out and just rip their fucking head off, bite into their neck. That's how, fuck, that's how fucking serious I am about this. I don't just do that for no reason, but that lion will literally just rip into your fucking neck and it will destroy you, it'll kill you instantly. Problem over. Another airplane. You see, I'm not gonna get distracted by that frequency of the airplane, but that's, that's literally it. I'm not violent. I'm not going out and just being all erratic. I'm protecting what is true and sacred. And those, those beings who don't have spiritual protection and want to go along with the virus, that, that is a, a death sentence. You're an existing vessel that is soon to be out of existence. Simple as that. I have strong spiritual energy within me. And, uh, The way that this realm is, is headed, it's going to be more spiritually dense. 